if you're feeling a little bit out of shape <coughs> after a month of celebrations, yep. now is the perfect time for a New Year's detox. But you can forget about expensive weight loss programs or strict diets. We've got an easy solution to shedding those extra kilos. All it takes is a few simple changes, Mon, in your meal okay. planning. Simple Good. as that. Joining us now is Sunrise nutritionist Susie Burrell. Uh, now, Susie, you're going to take us through a little New Year's detox program. What? Let's start with the foods we should be totally avoiding. Well, the things you should be avoiding are, of course, anything processed. So your packaged snack food mm -hmm. and munching the dips and the crackers and the soft drink and the mm. chocolate and all of those Christmas leftovers that really we should get rid of out of the house, otherwise we will keep munching. But the good news is it's really easy to detox or reset your diet at home with things you have. You don't need to go and buy expensive Ooh. programs or pills. You can absolutely rehab your diet at home with a few simple steps. OK, let's start with breakfast. How do we do it? Well, the best option is always a breakfast-type smoothie or juice. So the As more veggies you've with got, kale, right? we've got a recipe for a green smoothie, which is some mm. banana, some kale, some spinach, um, any of the milks that you like to have, add some of the good fats from the chia seeds, but literally any kind of vegetable-based juice or green smoothie is a great way to get rid of the extra fluid to start the day. It's a great habit to get into. You can make it the night before and then you're ready to go and it just gets you in that right mindset. And basically the more veggies and fresh food you put in it, the better. Susie, mm. speaking of which, every detox needs a healthy soup. Have we got one? It, well, I have a super soup that I've used for right. years with my clients. I call it the detox soup. Now, of course, it's a little bit odd at this time of you making a soup, but the beautiful thing about a soup is that it does shred some kilos quite quickly because it gets oh. rid of extra fluid from oh. the body. So we'll put my Good detox soup recipe up on the website. What sort of things have you got but in the there? The basic things are it's got celery, it's got leek, it's got onion, which is very good shredding type vegetables. We use a no added salt vegetable stock. And then basically you throw in whatever other vegetables you want, whether it's tomato, oh. pumpkin, all of the low carbohydrates, Hydrate veggies and a, a bowl or two of this each day I guarantee you'll lose a couple of kilos quite quickly really? and that again is just a great way to kickstart things get you on the right track remind you what it feels like to have some veggies into your diet and that's why soup diets have been quite successful in recent years so it's just a way of putting back all the goodness that we've yeah. taken out for the last few weeks because we've been overindulging in so many and high you calorie feel foods. quite full too you do and it just shreds down yeah, and gets rid right. of the blow to makes you feel good so if you really want to have a new regime to start starting with the veggie okay. juice and making yourself one of the, the detox soups up is a great way to start the new year the right way. Now obviously the fizzy drinks are the things to avoid. On the next podium over, mm. tell us what you've got there. Well we've got some healthy snacks because of course whenever you cut a lot of calories out of your diet you tend to be hungry all of the time yes. and the key thing to remember with your snack food choices is to focus them on protein rich foods. So the plain Greek yogurt, a handful of nuts, some cheese and some fresh fruit. So if you can limit snacking to once or twice a day and make sure that you've got these really nutrient rich choices you'll avoid going low with your blood glucose levels and reaching for the rice crackers and the potato chips and all the other things that we tend to grab when our blood glucose levels go low and we don't have the healthy snacks on hand. So planning your meals ahead and having those snacks is really important part of setting yourself up for dietary success in the new mm. year. Mm. Planning is a big part of it, isn't it? Just, it is. just setting it out and saying, this is, I'm going to stick to this. Planning is the key to dietary success. So yeah. if you're not quite ready to do it today the first, you're still recovering. If it's next Monday, go to the supermarket, do a big shop, get rid of all the rubbish from the household, make yourself a batch of detox soup, get your blender out ready to make your healthy yeah, smoothies good. and you'll start the year on the right foot without, as I said, having spent a lot of money on expensive pills and potions you don't need. Great. Lovely, Susie. Good to Great. Susie. It's interesting to see the Coke there. Imagine having a Coke at this time of the morning. Oh, unheard of, isn't it? <laughs> All right, Susie's smoothie and soup recipes are on our website as well as a day-by-day -day breakdown one over there. of recommended meals. Well, some things you have to do just to survive, Mom.